her mother was like, you know, Lifshay, but I heard the voice of my whole childhood. Her tapes and interviews and reading her book out loud. And she was always just there as if a person. Stories about her and sort of her epic tale. She like came to the United States, Lifshe, and then went back. Um, and she like came very young and she, I think like, you know, there's sort of folkloric surrounding, or maybe it was, I'm sure it's from her book, which I, um, I've read, but not in a while, um, about how she got her passage on a boat and she came here and she sang in the streets. She had this like beautiful, legendary vo voice and, uh, and then she went home. My dad grew up with her in the house. You know, I sort of cobbled together my own sort of image of her from many stories and growing up sort of knowing BKG who interviewed her and wrote a lot of, wrote her, recorded her and just, he, I heard her voice. And my family, you know, we do list, they listen to tapes all the time. I mean, always at the table, they were like telling stories of how, this time when everybody was sitting and they're, just so these images of like the whole Bainbridge, I feel like everybody who lived in the Bronx would come together and there was like all these, so many stories where like Lish and a bunch of people were sitting at the dining room table and then this person would come over, or, like this funny thing got said and then the funny thing sort of lost its initial meaning and just something we would still say or people would still talk about in our family. So it was like, she was very present though I, I never met her. She died when my dad was about 18, I think. And her voice, her music was some, like my, you know, Bela sang and my dad sings very beautifully, though he probably didn't say so in his interview. And uh, it was sort of, we've always like, she was the best, you know, <laughs> she, everyone sort of talked about Lifsha, like she was the best of us. And her voice was like very beautiful. And, and in our family sort of, she's discussed as being sort of this beautiful songbird who really got it and everyone else has sort of been approximating that ever since.